neuroplasticity, and how understanding it can improve your life. Being unhappy with your life and wanting a change might seem impossible, especially if you are at the stage in life where you consider yourself incapable of changing perspectives. But the truth is that the human brain is rewirable, and this is what the entire concept of neuroplasticity is about. Your thought processes, experiences, and environment can rewire your brain, making it possible to see a meaningful change in your life, regardless of how fixed the situation appears. Welcome to our channel, where we talk about issues relating to mental health, self-improvement, general medical problems, and the journey to overall wellness. If this is something that appeals to you, be sure to like this video and stick till the very end to see if this is something you want to subscribe to. Without further ado, let's head straight into the main topic of today's video. How understanding neuroplasticity helps you create your own brain and eight ways you can improve your life through neuroplasticity. Number one, experience healing. Your childhood experiences play an important role in your physical and mental health as an adult. The brain is equipped to help you adapt to your environment, but the process can be difficult when you are stressed. Traumatic experiences can cause lasting physical and mental health difficulties in the brain, which goes on to negatively affect your life. Experiencing healing from childhood trauma is possible with the help of neuroplasticity. Your age does not have to be a barrier here, because so long as you can experience new positive situations, you can rewire your brain from trauma. It is all a matter of creating new habits. You reinforce the experience and emotions you want to retain and stay away from those you consider harmful. Eye movement desensitization and reprocessing, EMDR, therapy might be helpful here. It changes the way your brain stores traumatic experiences such that you can now remember the event without reliving it. The brain's neuroplasticity enables the effectiveness of this medical procedure. Number two, find clarity. Improving your brain's plasticity involves changing your behaviors. For this to happen, you have to undergo the vital process of finding clarity. In doing this, you understand your goals better and the reason you want to accomplish those goals. This is the foundation of all real changes that occur in a person's life. Without taking this critical step, you might start your journey and find yourself stopping or procrastinating all the way. Finding clarity about your value system is a huge part of improving your life. Your values, traits, and priorities are all important features to work on to increase neuroplasticity because they influence your actions and help you find meaning in life. After experiencing years and years of conditioning, it is easy to lose yourself and watch your authentic dreams and desires slip away. With neuroplasticity, you can finally revive those essential values and pursue the things that really interest you. It is never too late to explore your passions, and this belief is at the core of neuroplasticity. As your brain's plasticity increases, you begin to feel fulfilled and take part in the things that matter. With time, this behavior progresses, and you challenge your brain to be even more receptive. Neuroplasticity may not be the easiest path, but consider how gaining clarity helps you align everything else to your interests, ultimately improving your life. Number 3. Experience Inner Calm Meditation is an important tool to embrace to practice mindfulness within yourself. By including it in your schedule, and training your brain to be mindful. You build regular practice. As your neuroplasticity improves, the gray matter in your brain changes, the connection between neurons occur, and you can get rid of old ones. This means since the brain never stops growing, you have the power to mold yours and reshape it for inner calm. The easiest way to track your brain to be calm is by practicing mindfulness meditation. By taking out some minutes of your time regularly to explore the inner workings of your mind, you can stop your mind from racing from one thought to the other. You will be within yourself and be aware of things happening around you. At that moment, you are simply present and not thinking about anything. For your brain to stick to the intended rewiring, you have to consciously seek out opportunities to practice mindfulness. Meditation aids in conditioning the mind 
and helps you manage negative states, like anxiety and fear. It may not be a solution to severe psychological stress disorders, but it will benefit your mood greatly. With time, you will notice how well you can hold off overwhelming emotions that cause you to worry unnecessarily. If you cannot dedicate time to meditation, as simple as pausing to process your emotions before taking an action would do a lot in helping you build neuroplasticity. Number 4. Improve Your Physical Health Exercising and neuroplasticity cannot be separated. Physical activity enhances brain function, so staying active is part of the new habits you pick up in a bid to increase brain plasticity. Neuroplasticity is a state the brain can naturally achieve, and physical activity boosts it by supporting blood flow to the brain. Staying active encourages optimal neuroplasticity in addition to the healthy bones and muscles you will enjoy. From strength training to cardio and balance exercises, your body benefits from all these forms of physical activities, for which your emotional and physical health will thank you. Exercise and a great diet go hand in hand, and both activities give the brain a boost. It all begins with prioritizing an exercise routine to aid neuroplasticity. And in no time, you are making the best health decision for your body. Number five. Silence your inner critic. The brain's capacity for rewiring means you can think of different thoughts and redirect your path in life. When your brain can think differently, you find it easier to respond to situations positively. The ability to generate new thoughts means you can create a new mind frame that is less likely to drown in self-criticism and negativity. Instead, you remodel your brain to think differently about who you currently are your actions, and your capabilities. Remember, the goal is to get rid of the negative voice holding you back and replace it with new thoughts that will elevate your life. By placing your inner critic in its rightful position, you make room for creative confidence and acknowledge that despite the situation, you can come up with great ideas. Our inner voices can be so convincing that it is sometimes difficult to believe otherwise. This is why retraining your brain is important to gain back control. Try shifting the focus away from yourself for a while by practicing empathy. It is another effective way to quiet the inner critic in you and improve life. Number 6. Handle Stress Better Neuroplasticity helps you to adjust how your body and brain respond to stress. Stress can be harmful to the brain, but you can learn to use it to your advantage. The human brain is more flexible than we give it credit for, and can learn to cope with stress in fascinating ways over time. For most people, stress comes with predictable patterns that trigger a range of negative emotions that bring out more stressful thoughts. It is a continuing cycle that you can beat by controlling how you respond to the trigger. Reacting differently to a particular situation is an exercise that helps in rewiring your brain's reaction to stress. You identify your triggers and consciously avoid them, but you can't stop there. Something else that comes with neuroplasticity is the resolve to take action in stressful situations. You learn to manage these situations either by working to improve them, accepting that they cannot be changed, or simply removing yourself from the situation. Stress will always be a part of human life, but you can ensure it has no power over you by allowing your brain to reorganize itself. Number 7. Remove Addictive Habits Habits are routines that have been so ingrained they are almost second nature. They are often hard to change because they have been repeated so much and sometimes even unconsciously. Your brain recognizes a pattern and stores the information neatly, making it difficult to break. It is like taking a trip. The more you travel a path, the quicker you get familiar with it. Developing neuroplasticity finally gives you an opportunity to break free from addictions. Addictive habits create structural changes in the brain, but the brain is also capable of picking up new coping skills. Although the brain forms familiar neural paths that become habits, it can create a new route by blocking the existing path. The new formation often involves an uncomfortable process 
But this difficulty is not permanent. This period of recovery can be tough because new neural connections are forming, but this is not the time to give up. So long as you manage to push through it, the new pathways will be more grounded and developed. Neuroplasticity allows you to take advantage of the brain's adaptability to learn new coping skills and fight addictive habits. Number 8. Acquire new skills. Productive people embrace life as a cycle of learning and development. During learning, there is the creation of new connections between neurons, which explains neuroplasticity. With practice, those connections become stronger and the nerve impulses are transmitted faster. This is a picture of what happens in the brain when you become better at skills or anything at all. On the contrary, with a lack of practice comes the weakening of neuron connections. The fact that practice can rewire your neurons shows how flexible the brain is and why this presents a learning opportunity. There is no room for anxiety since your brain has the natural ability to move you from a beginner into an expert at anything, provided you allow it. The human body is programmed to prefer easier things, but by pushing yourself a bit harder, you signal to your body the importance of an activity and encourage it to take up the challenge. Eventually, the neural connections become more strengthened and you can perform better at a specific skill. How long it takes for neuroplasticity to work differs from person to person. You can track your habits to see how much progress you are making towards rewiring your brain. Most of our behaviors are done subconsciously, but still, they are in our control. Through practice and experience, you can use your brain's flexibility to rewire its activities and improve your life. Neuroplasticity is powerful enough to bring about a major life shift, and now that you understand it, it can change yours. So, what are your thoughts on neuroplasticity? Sound off in the comments and give this video a thumbs up if you found it helpful. And don't forget to subscribe for more content like this. If you find this information helpful, we're sure you'll enjoy this other video from our channel too. Until next time, we wish you a happy and healthy day.